let's just let these cars go by. Let's let the cars go by. Bye, cars. See ya. Good riddance. Here, I guess we're on location. I guess we're on location here. Yeah, here we are. The B Vlogs on location at uh, a historic, historic, historical site. A historic, historical site, which is in fact the location, the shooting location of Space Rippers. That's this right here. This. That, look, nope, that way. That's where we shot Space Rippers. About, uh, about three years ago now. Three, three years ago. Space Rippers really, really, really burned me up. Really burned me up and burnt me out. Uh, it was, it was an ordeal. It was basically the classic, everything goes wrong indie feature. That looks amazing. Yeah. I said I wanted the Evil Dead experience, and I think I got the Evil Dead experience. You should never ask for that, because just let it happen naturally. Don't, don't ask for your production to be fucked up, because then it will get fucked up. Uh, I invest my own money, which was dumb. Don't do that. Never invest your own money. I didn't even invest my own money. I invested my own credit cards. Right there. Dumb move. I've been in terrible bone crippling debt. Bone or earth shattering debt. I'm sure people have a lot worse debt than me, so I shouldn't complain too much. But yeah, no, don't use your credit cards to shoot a movie, you idiot. 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 Yeah, man. Uh, they were supposed to tear this whole thing down. It was supposed to be leveled after we were done shooting. Well, there was one more rental after we were done shooting, and then that fall, I think, they were supposed to tear the whole thing down. And we were excited. We were going to get like some shots of them blowing up the building or tearing it down and be like, oh, there goes Space Ripper's location. Um, but they didn't. They didn't end up doing it, um, which is a shame because we totally fucked up the location. So I assume that this new liquor store now uh, has had to deal with Space Ripper stuff um, since their inception. We, we like had foam all over the walls and paint and goop and, and we didn't have money for waste disposal at the end of the production and we also didn't have time because we had to be at a location the day we finished shooting. So we basically just ripped everything down and shoved it in this like cellar they had. I'm sure it's still down there. Uh, I, like I say, I haven't been in since. Uh, I kind of want to wait and I want to go with Chris because uh, I think that would be fun and we could just go take a lot down there. Maybe there's some Space Rippers memorabilia. I'm going to try to go into a side street so it's maybe a little bit quieter. I say that now and it's quiet here. But no, I'm going to go walk down the side street and then maybe uh, talk some more. But yeah, there, there it is. That's, that's it. Look, over there. Hello. Go away. Go, go, go. right on the cliff thing but that doesn't matter this is a b vlog a bad vlog i'm not gonna apologize for it being bad it's right in the name b vlog so just suck it up it's gonna be bad this is only this is only like two blocks away from our uh where we shot space rippers and in fact actually we shot just over there back there uh we shot one of the um uh, creep miss shorts What were we talking about? Yeah, space rippers. And it's coming together, it's finally coming together. Um, and I'm hoping now uh, I can use these b vlogs or b vlogs, bad vlogs, to kind of bring you on the journey of our filmmaking from space rippers until wherever we're going next. Like learn from our mistakes. Cause we, we had a lot of mistakes, we had a lot a lot of mistakes we still make a lot of mistakes I'm gonna to continue to make a lot of mistakes um, like I don't even know how to use my camera that's a mistake I probably should have learned how to do that so what else happened on space rippers man we flooded the location um, yeah I think it was like two days into the shoot and uh, <laughs> and uh, it was like one of the rainiest Januaries we chose the rainiest January in like years and um, like two days into the shoot 
started pouring down and just like soaked everything inside. And then it proceeded for like the next three days to rain, I think even more inside the building than it was raining outside the building. Which was wonderful, which was great. We had these buckets everywhere. We had Cody's gear covered in like flags so that uh, hopefully we wouldn't destroy his beautiful 4K camera and uh, all of his gear that he was giving us for free. Um, but uh, yeah, I can't believe he trusted us with all that gear. What are you doing? You hardly knew us, Cody. Why did you give us all that gear? You're far too trusting. In fact, actually, I'm gonna come clean now. I stole your camera. I did. I stole it. And then I replaced it with, um, with just a GoPro. That's just a case. I just made that plastic case, blow like um, uh, 3D printed that case and then just put a GoPro in it. You've been just using a GoPro. Ah! You've been using a, that was a mosquito. You've been using a GoPro for the last like, uh, three years um, because I've replaced your camera with a GoPro. I've got a mosquito bite on my pinky finger. What the fuck is that? But I think that's it for now because my battery's gonna die. And um, that's all she wrote, that's all I have to say. This was fun. And I'll see you soon. Goodbye. Godspeed. Look at this great view again. Look at that. I'm glad I got that stock footage stuff. Right now I'm holding this the wrong way so that it might just fall out of my hand. Look, look, look. Uh... Uh, bye bye.